Hi you guys, it's Jenny with Planner Perfect. Today we're gonna to talk about how to create tabs for, uh, you know, anything I'm using for my plan books. And uh, I have been getting some requests on how to create those tabs, uh, specifically using the plan books. So I'm gonna go ahead and show you how. Um, these here are the little tabs. I've only got one hand here and how I'm using it. So uh, you guys will definitely get the idea by the time we're done. How I use mine are for um, for my traveler's notebook. I use them in my plan books, and I use them for to divide my goal from my day to day pages. Um, here it says May daily um, on through the months. Right now, um, I'm currently moved over to my black uh, creme brulee uh, wide chick sparrow, and I am in love. So here we are in my August. Um, and I wanted to show you how it is used for me, the tabs, and I've got my calendar pages, and this is the Planner Perfect method and setup, okay? And what we do is you've got your calendar for the month, then comes your goals, and this is where you're going to put down all of your dreams, your goals, what you want to do to take care of yourself. We're going to go in depth in that. Uh, I have another video on that coming up here within the next couple days, so I'll get into deep with that. Everything that you need to harness those month's goals with its details go here. Then come your day-to-day. -day. And to help mark it, this is where I'd put a, um, a journal card. And I just haven't gotten there yet, but also, too, this helps mark it. And this is where I put my daily tab, okay? So um, it's super easy. I bought it on Amazon. It's just a tab marker. Check it out. I will put the link below for you to be able to buy it yourself and here's what I'm going to be working in um, I even had um, her right plan book on the bottom I'm in love with this color information on this down below um, another chick sparrow of course and um, this is actually going to be a narrow for me so I'm going to kind of go into a narrow and see how I like it but um, I've actually had so many orders I haven't been able to even really take care of my own uh, planning as much as I'd like because usually I would be way in more advanced in all my books by now but I will get to it here's my September and uh, I do offer this on my Etsy shop as well but here is an example of what we're gonna do here's my October um, so I want to create a daily page now I haven't even gotten in here yet but what I'm gonna do is I would be marking off a good chunk since there especially since there is so much paper in here um, I like to leave a lot of room for goals I do because there's wardrobe needs there's going to be school needs. There's going to be I, so much that you need to save for and a script for your that month's goals. So uh, make sure you get like a good chunk, like six, seven, up to ten. I mean, don't cut yourself short. There's a lot of paper in here. So after you do that, you put it because you got to leave room. Your calendar is going to be in here, right? And then you've got your chunks of paper for your goals. Then you're going to put. I'm going to be putting in right here my um, tab. So how we do this is, as you can see on the back, there it is. And you would just be using some cardstock or whatever you want of your choice. Um, that was a little cute, cute little journal card I used. But here's a heart. And you can actually just script it on the back. And then on the other side could be the color. So when you turn the page, you'll see it. Here's a kind of even a Christmas one here. But uh, anyway, these are the tabs that punch out of this. Super easy. Then it comes with these. It comes with one packet, and then I ordered several extra. But it's just the little, um, if you can see it, the little adhesive. Super easy. Self-explanatory. Um, and that's why I know you guys will get the gist of it by me using just one hand. I already stuck in the one right here on the sticky side right where the same alignment of where it um of its shape and then all you're going to do is you bend it do you see and i'm not even going to be able to do it on here but you'd bend it right on those between just on that one page and there will be your tab do you see isn't that great get yourself one i think you're gonna love it um there you guys, there you guys go. That's how you do tabs. 
links below. Stay tuned in a couple days for how I do and uh, have done my July plan book all the way through the end with a um, sneak peek into my August plan book. Talk to you guys soon and hope you enjoyed making some tabs. Bye-bye.